Okay, this time with a box. Is it even possible to not fall down? Alright, this time I think I need to give this one a toss. Oh, well, that was bad. Okay, okay. Maybe I do need to do a jump, but maybe like a crouch jump? I don't know. I only have one more box that I can spare. Ah! No, 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 no. No, no. No falling down. We're not falling down. Come on. Move. Okay, okay. Are we in? Are we up? Are we up? We're good. We're still alive. We've still got a box. Um, maybe I can put it over here? I don't want to, though. It's scary. This is all very scary. Um, come on. Come on. I can't reach. And I don't think I can lift and throw this box. Maybe if I, like, go like this. And swing myself. Ah, that can work. This can work. No, 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 no. Okay. Keep trying. Swing. 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 And swing. No. <laughs> I keep not letting go with one hand. Come on, Boneworks. Swing it my... S swing it along. Okay. Okay. We're good. We're good. We're okay. Everything is okay. This is the intended way to do it, I'm sure. There's nothing nothing going wrong here. This box is definitely not falling off an edge. This is totally fine. Okay. As long as the box makes it across, everything else is okay. I can make it across on my own. Yes. Yes. Okay. Jump. We're good. We did it. We did it, we did it, we did it, we did it. Okay. Boy. I haven't mentioned yet how janky Boneworks is. <laughs> it really is the jankiest game. Uh, okay, well, we made it, I think. To somewhere? Okay, where the heck are we? Prepare thyself. Yeah, well, that's where everybody was battling, right? Okay, how do I prepare thyself? With a shield? And a sword? And that's the only thing that's here? Nothing behind these crates? Probably not. Okay. Shield. Sword. Alright. Okay. Let's earn an audience with the king, then. Is he the king? I mean, we've already got an audience. But I guess we need an audience with the king. But I, mean, I guess he's not the king. Okay. We got the ones with VR headsets on them. Ah! Okay. Yeah, they hurt. They hurt alright. Okay, this is not gonna be easy. Ah, this is... This is janky. Okay. It's easy to get my sword stuck in them. I don't think stabbing is the way to go, though. Okay. Yeah. Stabs are... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Out of my way. Out of my way. I think stabs are one-hit kills. Maybe. Eh. Stab. Okay, you. He has powers and a headset. Okay, that was good. How many waves are there gonna be? Does that say something over there? Exit? Can I get through here? Ah, oh, no, it won't let me. Yeah, what up, son? Agreed. Okay, this isn't too bad so far, but... Fortunately, one stab does the job. Um, alright, I'm dead, aren't I? Or close to it? 
Okay, I'm dead. I kept getting shot in the back by those energy blasts. Okay, let's try that again, except without getting shot in the back. I think we can do this, though. I just don't know how many waves there's going to be. This, this could get tough. Okay, here we go. Yeah, sure, just, um... Just tell me how many waves there's going to be. <laughs> this is problematic. Stab. Do these barriers block their attacks? If so, I want to kill these guys as quick as possible before they break down all the barriers. That way it'll give me some defense. There we go. Okay. Where are they coming from next? Here? In there? Alright. A lot of them came from this side last time. Okay. Just stab them all. I'm stuck on something. Oh, my shield's stuck. Oh, come on, die already! Why aren't they dead? Whoa! Just gotta go for the neck, maybe. <laughs> Alright, get off! Get off of there! It's stuck! I guess I'm gonna have no shield. That's fine. Ah! No, I'm dying. That's not good. Okay. Alright, we're, we're fine. We're fine. We're not dying yet. We just gotta use our fencing skills. I mean, I'm a fencer. In real life. So I should be able to do this. Alright. Well, that works. Um, Alright, round three. Coming from those two sides. Alright. The spawning. There's one, uh, one guy with ranged weapons there. Here we go. Ah, away from me. Ooh, that hurts. Oh, did this area just kill? They just killed each other. Okay. Yeah, I just have to go for their neck. Okay, okay, okay. You need to go away. I can't have a laser guy shooting at me. They're the ones that hurt the most. Alright. Whoa! They do hurt each other, though. Ow. Okay, stay away. Headshot. Whoa! Oh my gosh, another one. I don't like the guys who shoot projectiles. I don't have a shield to block them with anymore. <laughs> so they're basically guaranteed damage on their part. Join me in the throne room for a 1v1. Oh, really? <sighs> okay, well, uh, they've seen enough, apparently. You, shield! You betrayed me! What is wrong with you? What a untrustworthy shield. Yeah, it's stuck in there pretty good. Okay, whatever. Let's just head on out. Ah, <sighs> exit. Exit to where? The throne room, I guess. Although this does not look like a throne room. Whoa! Okay, where are we? This is not what it looked like I was going into. But this does look like a, uh, a castle. Some castle grounds. All of this will be, all of it will be mine when I beat you. How wonderful! We've got some headsets on people's faces, crushing a little girl or something, or a little boy or someone, and more VR headsets attacking. We've got a wonderful water fountain with no water, just some light particle effects.
Okay. I can't enter? How do I enter this? Do I climb up? Oh, maybe I climb up. Possibly? Can't tell if that's correct or not. Yeah, there's these grabby panels. Okay, so I'm supposed to climb all the way up to the top and fight him. Whew, well, I'm basically done for today. I kind of want to stop. But, since we seem to be so close to the end, I can't stop here. We're going to try to make a climb. At least once. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Good, this is all grabbable. Now we just have to deal with the incredibly janky and bouncy boneworks climbing. The way we bounce away from and then close to the wall is really disorienting. Okay, it looks like he can make it up there. Up we go. Let's just do it quickly before we explode. Oh, this moves. Doesn't it? Is this going to fall down when we climb up it and have us do it again? Yep. I knew it. I knew it. I saw that coming, but there was nothing I could do to avoid it. Okay, back up again. Thank you, Boneworks devs, for putting that in. Something that I could not seem to avoid, even though I saw it coming. Okay. Up we go. Up we go. We're back again. All right, they made me do that twice. How wonderful. Climbing is definitely not my favorite part of Boneworks. Okay. Well, let's not, let's not fall down again. That would have been our fault. Okay, so there must be some way to climb these then uh, that I was trying to do before. I was trying to climb these before and then it just wasn't possible. There must be some way to do it considering the fact that there's one here in such a conspicuous fashion. But I don't know. Okay. No, no, no. Well, I mean, I guess that works. All right, how am I supposed to get up here? I can do this. Then I can do this. Then get onto the yellow pipe. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, okay. Let's, uh, let's get ourselves on here. Okay, we're good, we're good. Here's some noise up there. I don't know what it is. No. Emergency door unlock button. Don't open. So clearly we're going to click it. Um, Alright, did that open the front door? Is that all that did? Let's climb up and see. Up we go. Alright, this is where that guy was before. I don't see anything up here. Oh, yep, here this goes. Oh, I'm up. I did not fall. Yeah, this is where he was, but it doesn't look like uh, he's up here anymore. So I guess through the front door we go then? Yep, probably. We did the emergency door unlock, right? So this has to be right. Here we go. A guy with a crowbar and a flashlight. And somebody T-posing. Wonderful. Now how is this boss battle gonna go? I don't have any weapons. More T-posing? It's like an amalgamation of those two guys we saw back there. Well, let's, uh, let's keep a plate. It's better than nothing. Oh, I can't store it. Whatever. We'll keep a cup. We need something to use as a weapon. Hello. You've come all this way. Do so! Uh, oh, okay. We're fist battling. Okay. Ow. 
Well, I have probably have health regeneration, and you probably don't. So I can probably just wait out your damage. Oh. Come on. Um, also, maybe I can use this to my advantage? Can I grab this? I think that works. Somehow. Let's try this. Ooh, you tried to punch through that. Get over here. Ah! I hit my headset. Ooh, he's not looking so good. Um, hi there, guys. I wonder if there's something else I can throw at him. I just kind of want to throw more things at him. This thing especially looks great for whacking. Oh, I don't want to do slow-mo. And whack! Yeah, I don't think you like that. Oh, yeah, he's not happy. Okay, he's still alive. He's definitely got some what look like bullet holes, which doesn't really make a lot of sense. Well, he's still laughing. Oh, why did I, how did I grab that? Um. I want more stuff to throw at him. <laughs> I feel like that's a good way to hurt him, but I think I'm almost all out of stuff. Pot. Okay. Don the crown. Don the crown? What if I give it to one of you guys, or what if I just leave? I'd rather just leave, to be honest. I don't want this crown. I don't know what it's going to do to me. Let me out. What if I give one of these guys the crown? There, you're the new king. No? Okay, he doesn't seem to care. Can I get out of here? Eternal salvation? Certain damnation. Let's go to certain damnation. Do they lead to the same place? Maybe? It says don the crown. I'm not going to. I mean, maybe I will, but... Hi. Dude, they found you in the old offices. I mean, like, the physical world version of you. How are you even still in there? That doesn't even make any sense. I mean, technically the... Look, you gotta get out of there right now. Okay. Well, I don't want to put on this crown. What I do want to do... So there's a button here, and there's a lever here. Okay. Please wear that. No? Okay, fine. No, whoa, 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 um. Oh, I didn't mean to hurt you like that. Sorry, dude. I just trying to give you a crown. Excuse me, sirs. Uh, lift up. Lift down. Wasn't that supposed to do something? Um, excuse me. <laughs> These guys are very confused. Stop. Don't open. What's this? Oh, this is one of those weapons that it didn't let me use. What? The USB thing? No? 
I don't get what she's trying to say, to be honest. More ammo? Why do we need more ammo at this stage? Aren't we pretty much done? Is there going to be more battling to come? I figure we're close to the end of the game at this point. Maybe I'm wrong? More batteries. What do I do with them? Alright, I think I'm supposed to open this, right? But let's move these off. We'll grab it. We can't grab it. Oh, yes I can. That's too heavy? Oh, you know what? That weapon. Where'd that weapon go? Here we go. Can I move this? Yes. Useful for moving heavy objects. Got it. Perfect. Up we go again. Move over here. And does this lift it now? I'm confused. Seems like it wants to lift. Take this crown with us. You never know, it could be useful. Um, I probably should have bring the elevator down, shouldn't I? Um, lift, please? Let's try it like this. Come on, lift. <laughs> trying to use the desk to lift this thing. It's vibrating. Maybe I lift it with my hands? No? Okay. Stay inside. Oh, what's that? Ah. Okay, this seems relevant. But it doesn't look like it extends far enough to grab this thing and lift it open. So how am I gonna... How am I gonna do this? Um, hmm. Alright, well first off, let me get back up. Can I hit the button? No. What if I use this? Can I hit the button now? Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's one way to hit the button. Let's not uh, make the mistake of using the elevator without hitting the button this time. Alright, is there anything else that can help us here? We've got a lot of power cells. I don't know if that matters. Is this one drained or something? No, it doesn't seem like it. Hmm. Okay, I must be missing something. I'll get back to you guys when I figure out what I'm doing here. Oh, this might work. This is what a crowbar is for, right? If I uh, use the other end, and I put it under, and I pry it. No, <laughs> okay. Oh, what am I doing? I'm such an idiot. There's a button literally right there, and I even saw it when I came in. All right, we'll hit it with a memory dump. How about that? No. Come on. Give it a better toss. Almost. Almost. Oh, wait, I can do that. There you go. Okay, I don't know why I was so stupid before. <laughs> we can just grab this and hook it in, right? Come on. Okay. Come on. We can we can get it. It's very close. Uh, 
Eh. Oh, if this thing wasn't so spinny and janky. Get, get in there. Come on. Rotate. Rotate, please. Let's, uh, let's just spin it like this. Now will it work? Come on. Yes! Okay, finally. Alright, now, uh, press the button. Okay, we opened it. Now what did that do? Anything? Nothing? Maybe we have to press the, uh, or move the thing again? Up here? Let's take that with us. Alright, let's try this again. Um, can you guys get out of my way? These guys are really in the way sometimes. It goes down. Uh, let's take this. Okay, this is doing something. Chamber 2. Oh. They tried to follow me. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay. They... They really want to follow me for whatever reason. Okay, can you not? Oh, hello. All right. Well, I've got I've got some special weapons this time around. Let me take this and let me fling these guys around. Oh, great! Large ones? No, I definitely don't want a large one. I just smack them against the ground a few times. Looked like these guys were going to help me a little bit. They got into uh, fighting mode. Whoa! No, no, get off of me. Um, I'm just going to run. <laughs> I'm just going to run. It's too many. Let's just, uh... Let's just run. This is a long walk. It's quite the open area, too. Scared something big is gonna attack me along this way. But it looks like we've still just got the same old enemies. Um, except for that exceptionally large VR headset. Ooh, okay. Thought that was the end, but I guess we've got a lot more to go. Something going on up here. Oh, it's another long climb. Oh boy. All right, let's see if we can store this. We can, wonderful. Oh, there's a crowbar as well. Can I climb this? Yes, I can. All right, we've got another long climb to go, so I'm gonna take a break before I uh, attempt this. All right, I'm back from my break, and I'm ready for some more nauseating climbing experiences in Boneworks. Actually, I really love the combat in this game, and I like how they give you lots of enemies to shoot. I like the way the guns work, but boy, the climbing and the platforming, definitely my least favorite part of this game. If they could remove that and just have lots of combat, that would be fine by me. Okay, let's uh, spin ourselves around here. Climb ourselves up. Get my head out of the way. Okay. This is working. This is working. Just, um... Eh. There we go. Let's flip ourselves around again. Alright, we're making progress. As long as there's no box at the top that's going to... drop off as soon as we grab it. Let me adjust myself even more here. There we go. Now I can reach up into the air without hitting any wires. Wait, no. There we go. Come on. No, no, don't get my hand stuck in the rungs. That's bone works for ya. Getting things stuck in everything. 
Well, this is a long climb. Okay, this is gonna take a while. I might skip this part for you guys. Oh, looks like I found a break in the action over here. Um, let's, uh, let's see if we can get up there. Or get over there. And... Maybe there's stuff over here to check out? Oh, Man. I feel like this game is masochistic sometimes, the way it makes you <laughs> climb for ages. And this stuff is breaking under me, and I do not want to fall. I do not want to fall. I do not want to fall. Okay. Um, I feel I have a feeling I shouldn't have gone over here. <laughs> but what are these? Oh. They stick together? Ooh. Can this let me climb like this? Oh. Okay. Okay, that works. I don't know how much it's gonna help me right now. I mean, it helps me not need a ladder. But does this does this really matter at all? I don't know. I mean, I do already have a ladder. Oh, I'm concerned about doing it this way though because uh, it's not a method I'm used to. I'm concerned that I'll <laughs> screwed up and end up falling down. It seems to be working out all right though, as long as I don't let go of them. Okay, I've positioned myself almost over the uh, solid platform, which will make me much happier. There we go. That way if I fall, at least I have some chance of still staying up here. Some interesting geometry on these things. Okay. We're making our way. Oh, come on. Get up the rest of the way. I can't even see anything right now. Reach! Okay. Okay, 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 we're up. <laughs> we're up! Um, let's store this. Um, maybe. Can we store these? Uh, I don't think I need a battery. Whoa. Did that work? Is that both of them stored? No. Uh, Alright, I'd have to uh, free up a slot in order to carry both, so I'm not going to. We'll carry one. As much as that probably won't help us. Goodbye, all things. Old myth. All consuming the pool storms forth. Doomed we live on. Okay. Whatever you say. Crazy ramblings. Oh, that didn't work. Okay. Maybe I do need these little things. Come. Let's uh let's get the other one out again. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't know what's going on with my hand. Okay, we got rid of the menus. <laughs> That was bizarre. Um, Alright, I don't know what the correct way to do this is, but... I guess we're gonna be climbing up like this. Because... What, what, what was it? Okay. We're gonna climb up like this because I don't know any other way to do it. No clue if this is right. But then we're gonna make it right. As long as the jankiness of Boneworks decides to cooperate, if the jank is on our side, we will make it. Yes. Yes, we're getting there. Okay. So let's just get around this ladder. Maybe. Um, maybe? Okay, never mind. We won't get around the ladder. We'll go to the other side of the ladder. How about that? Here we go. Um, alright, this is getting us somewhere, alright. Nice, nice. Okay, 
This is one way to use a ladder. Let's uh, rotate ourselves. We did it! We're somewhere! I don't know where, but we're somewhere! It looks like we've got another, uh... Another one of these screens. It's gonna show us a cutscene type nonsense. Origin? Oh, people are coming in to stop me or something like that? I don't know if I, if I have this right. Oh! Um... Let me reload, because I know this is not a full mag. Oh, they killed me. Now I'm stuck in here? I really wish I had some kind of sight on this weapon. I don't, though. Um... Oh, that's the end? That's a weird end. So I died in real life? And now I live on in here? I don't have my, uh... I don't have my crown, though. My crown's way back there. How am I supposed to live on as the ruler of this place without my crown? Hmm. Is this really the end? If so, it's a very interesting ending. In the meantime, while the credits are rolling, I guess we'll climb more stuff because that's Boneworks. So let's just climb to the top. Might as well. Stress level zero. Okay, now what's gonna happen? Fade to black. More jankiness? Oh, fade to black. Okay. Oh, and here we are with a crate. What do we get in the crate? Is it another bouncy ball? What is this? What is this? What do we get? Arena Fantasy Land. Oh, is that. Is this like a key to the arena mode? What do, what, do, what, do I do, what do I do with this? Um, looks like it goes over here. Sandbox something or other. Um, uh, uh, does that do something? It doesn't go here, so it goes here. Okay. Well, I have no clue what that means or if that does anything. Should I be knowing what I'm doing right now? I don't think I should be knowing what I'm doing right now. Okay, well I plugged in the thing. And I need a, I need a, a key. Yep, I don't get it. Well, that's all right. I'm pretty sure that, I'm pretty sure that was the game. I'm pretty sure we finished it. Um, bit of a strange ending there. There was a there was a climactic boss battle with the the king guy <laughs> who we we punched to death. And I figured actually it was going to be the end there where we picked a path and then we basically chose an ending Dark Souls style <laughs> where we want to decide how how the story actually ended. I don't know if that was what we ended up doing or not. Maybe maybe that maybe it is what happened maybe if I put on the um, the crown we would have ended things differently but I'm not sure in the end we ended up sort of just running away to a place where we saw ourselves get shot in the back of the head and now we're eternally in this myth OS monogon VR hellscape filled with 
nausea inducing climbing puzzles and platforming? I think I have that right. <laughs> Regardless, the story was kind of incomprehensible to me. I'm, I'm sure other people were able to figure out what was going on probably a lot better. I've never been the best with trying to figure out bizarre storylines like this. I was really trying to though. It seemed like we had two people trying to advise us. There was the guy who wanted us to maybe shut things down, I guess, and there was the, the lady who wanted to us to leave a way in or something like that. So apparently a lot of people still want to be in this MythOS hellscape <laughs> and we kind of destroyed it? Or did we? I mean, we defeated the we defeated the the king of it. That was it. Did we really do anything other than that in this in this whole insanity mess that we've just completed? There was all those soldiers trying to defend the place. I'm not sure why. Still, there's clearly some weird stuff going on with those those multicolored creatures that we were trying to shoot at at the end. There, I still don't know what that was all about. And before we went into that final area, there was some sort of, there was that multicolored creature that led us into the area that said, like, welcome home or whatever. We had to break through and we went into blackness. So maybe we were just, let we just exist in some sort of weird void now. Maybe we did destroy MythOS and now we're just nowhere. And also we got killed in real life. Is that what happened? And maybe if we put on the crown, then we would have become like the ruler of MythOS and it would live on? Uh, that might be how it is. I actually, I still don't know. <laughs> I can only speculate at this point because I just, I, I can't understand it. But that's all right. Uh, <laughs> so the good points about this game, there was the, the combat for sure. The combat was tons of fun. As janky as it is, the the gunplay, the the way that, I, even, even the way that, even though everything is all, all wiggly, uh, the melee combat was definitely really annoying because of that. The guns all felt really good to use. Um, I didn't like how you could grab a magazine over here, because <laughs> every time I tried to pick something up, it would end up grabbing a magazine. That was really annoying. But everything felt reasonably easy to use. I would have liked to have more variety in the weapons that this game allowed. Um, it seemed like I was running into the same weapons over and over. There were two types of pistols, and there were a submachine gun and an assault rifle, and that was sort of it in terms of weaponry. Well, I guess there was melee weapons as well, but most of those didn't really feel too well to actually use. I really did like that that section where you're trying to prove your worth to the king and you've got the shield and the sword. That felt really satisfying to do, stabbing all of those guys. Especially for me, since I do fencing in real life, it's, it's, I, I enjoy good stabbing. So I felt like that was a really good section. This game had, uh, had some pretty interesting levels and some pretty interesting level design, but uh, I felt like the level design, it, so they made all sorts of jokes where they would say like concrete texture and they were like plaster like a plain concrete texture on things and uh, they'd have a lot of sort of really simple textures like this to try to give the feel that this was sort of a unfinished or really rough type of virtual world that was maybe just in beta or something like that but uh, it also gives the impression that the game itself is like that uh, and it kind of, the jankiness kind of gives you that feel as well. So I think maybe they could have pushed in maybe a different direction and that could have worked a little bit better instead of having these really bland, um, repeating textures and things like that. I understand that, uh, it's a design choice, the, the way they did it, or, it, I mean, I hope it was a design choice, but I think the game could be a lot cooler. <laughs> if it just looked a little bit nicer in certain ways. Not to say that the game didn't look nice. Oh, there's a key here. Not to say that the game doesn't look nice because it actually does. But wait, am I actually figuring out things here even at the end? Wait, is there more I can be doing? Should I, should I not be doing my closing statements? Is there more going on here than I realize? Oh, what's this emergency exit by the way? Oh, is that the quit? That's probably to quit the game. I actually probably don't want to push that. I don't know why I never took a good look around here before. 
Okay, I think that was everything. I think I found everything here. Looks like I'm still missing some sort of module here with something about a sandbox. Um, but I'm not going to worry about that. So back to my thoughts on the game then. I thought this game was <laughs> was actually pretty scary at times. Uh, some of those enemies, the, the VR headsets that jump on you and latch onto your face, those things are really scary. The, uh, the way those soldiers popped out at me and... <laughs> and uh, scare the crap out of me, that was pretty scary. Uh, honestly, this game, I feel, is scarier than Half-Life Alex. I don't I don't generally like to compare games that often, so sorry that I keep comparing this to, to the new Half-Life game. But I really got a sense of danger in this game because of how many enemies there were. That's one criticism I, I would say of the, the new Half-Life game, is that they don't give you a lot of enemies to shoot. I know why they do that. They don't want Alex to be overpowered with respect to Gordon, and also it's a it's a beginner's VR game, so they don't want to overwhelm players with enemies. But this, I really loved how they would overwhelm you with lots of enemies in the in Boneworks. I thought that was wonderful. That gave me a great challenge. Uh, that's definitely the best part of this game is just shooting enemies left and right, hitting them with your uh, with whatever weapons you've got, punching them. So that was wonderful. Now, in the end, I'm really glad I played this game. I will probably check out the uh, the, the battlefield mode or the sandbox mode or some other things, um, but I'll probably do that on my own just so I can uh, enjoy shooting people a bit more because I know there's a mode like that where you can just constantly obliterate opponents. That sounds like a lot of fun. I probably will not play the story mode again. Too much climbing for me. That's definitely one of the sore points of this game is the climbing, even if you've got your VR legs and it doesn't make you all seasick, I still don't think it would be cool enough to justify the wonkiness in the actual climbing where you try to grab onto something and your face does this constantly while you're trying to go up. I mean, that's just, that's not a fun experience, not immersive, it's not, it's not anything. Um, so I really wish that they Tone that down a little bit in this game, although I know they're really trying to go for uh, just displaying as much physics nonsense as they could, and uh, they really went for it. It was just not for me, but I do understand why they did it, and I'm sure a lot of people did find that a lot of fun. And that's all I got to say about this. I probably will watch some people play through Boneworks to see if they can possibly decipher what was actually going on here. Uh, I still feel confused even at the end of it here. Um, I want to see if maybe there are other endings, and I would like to see if other people were as freaked out about certain times in this game as I was, because uh, I found this game pretty scary <laughs> at, certain, at certain points. In the end, I'm really glad I played this game. It really helped me get my VR legs in. I really needed that <laughs> before I got onto other games. So this was a great way to just force myself to be <laughs> comfortable in VR. I'll just leave it there. So thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.